Okay guys, welcome back. I am about to swirl the headstock neck for that yellow squire. I'm pleased with the way the uh, swirl turned out, so I'm going to keep it, finish it out, kind of call it the uh, uh, sun drop. You know, so I'm doing the white a little bit different here. Well, as long as I get a good base coverage, then that's all I want is a good white base coverage. And this is going to be concentrated in the middle because uh, it's just the neck. But what I want to do is I'm dipping the neck. I'm dipping the neck all the way through, so I want to be covered from the top to the heel, from the headstock to the heel. I want good coverage. So as I do this, like I said, I don't want to use a whole lot of paint in oils or in swirling paints on water. The motto is less is more. So the less, if you, if you go in thinking you need a whole lot of paint and you cut that idea in half, you, you'll be all right. I think that's going to be it. I'll let this, like I said, congeal, come together. I'll move it around a little bit, very little movement, and then I'll uh, dip it. Just come together. I like to bring it to the middle. I want to bring my white in here. And then I'll bring my gray in the middle. And I'll go ahead and dip my neck. This time I'm going to use some newspaper to move that water aside. So here we are. Here we go.
There we go. I really can't hold it. I got to put it on a hanger. So here's the headstock and the neck. Turn it, turn it. There we are. I don't know if you can see that. There's the headstock. And then the neck. Try to get you a good shot of that before I hang it up. Okay, here I am. I'm back. I'm just going to give you a good shot as I go through. There's the headstock. And then here's the neck. This came out real good for matching up with the body. Here we are.